Welcome to another App Manager 8 video. My name is Michi Schniebel and I'm Product Manager for App Manager. So in this video I will talk about the new export functionality in Control Center and let's start with the basics and I use the server view to show you the basics. So I do a right click in my uh, server list here and the last item in that context menu is the print export email feature and since I'm in a list it will always ask me to export just the selected object or all objects in the list in this case servers so I go with all and I get a new dialog and that is the export dialog and what you can see here is the view with all its columns you selected in the view um, and you can now go and print or export them but I want to tweak them first because uh, let me show you something here um, change the view that's not the list I want to provide to people you know it's spreading out to several pages um, and I don't want to go and glue them when I print them so so let's tweak them um, go back to the 100% zoom level here um, we have some options to do that the first is I want to remove the vertical lines here I don't need them um, instead I could use color coding but I don't want to do that as well um, and the other one is uh, in the behavior you have the auto width and that's a neat feature um, I will enable that and now it's a little bit better but still some columns on the second page so next thing I do is I use the narrow margins getting better and better but still not all columns on one page so last thing I can do is I can scale down um, my content to 90% and now I have everything on one page so let me show you you see it's a continuously list and and that's what I want and I want to export that list now to PDF so I go to my export button here and you see all the formats we support and uh, I choose PDF I can put in some properties for the PDF but I don't need that put it on my desktop and replace the existing one as this is not the first time I do this video and yes I want to open it and here's my nice PDF um, you see that's that's something you really can provide people to give them information what servers are monitored or what what is the status of the service currently etc etc so lots of uh, opportunities with that feature okay uh, let's go back to control center and let me show you where else you have that feature available let me select all my servers in that list uh, by hitting control a um, and now I have them all selected and down here in the detail uh, tab I see the nice list of you know what operating system what service pack is on that server I can right click here as well and do the same thing and now I get a list of um, of all my servers with their uh, detail information and you see I can tweak further to you know make it work on one page but it remembers my uh, previous settings so once I do the settings it will remember this which is nice and you know I don't have to do a lot other than uh, to scale it down that's the only thing that will not be remembered and then I have everything on one page and I can export this uh, this time I want to export it as a CSV file and bring it up here and here you go you can import that to Excel or use it to um, do whatever you like so where else is that feature available pretty much in all our views um, so in the event view in the job view and the knowledge script view uh, you can export all the content um, but also in areas where you might don't expect it uh, like the security area here if you have a long list of users or groups or permissions you have an export button here as well and you can just go and export that information to PDF or whatever format you like 